Welcome, football fans, to Green Bay, Wisconsin. I'm Dave Stevens, along with my partner, Mike Steele. Any given Sunday. Sure, it sounds cliche, but we really are entering one of those matchups. Two teams who don't need much of an introduction, getting ready to show us why they should be considered among the league's best. You know, I couldn't agree more, Mike. I think that both of these teams have something to prove today. And he's brought down after a return of 13. The home team starts the drive from the 31, takes the toss to number 27. Second down and short. Go! Walter on the carry. And he crosses the goal line for a touchdown. Sometimes these goal line runs are about patience and waiting for gaps to develop. And sometimes it's about hitting the hole as fast as you can. It's good. Green Bay strikes first today. Seven, nothing. The away team is back on their heels now. But if they can come out and match that score, it'll swing the momentum back in their favor. Bugai takes the kick. And he's brought down after a return of 28. This is a pressure drive for the offense. They've got a chance to pull back into the driver's seat with a score on this possession. Sacked. Loss of six. Well, we'll see if that holds up after the penalty. Miami will accept the penalty. If the coach hasn't created a culture where penalties are not acceptable, then players won't take that extra effort to avoid making them. Throws a fastball along the sideline. Well, we'll see if that holds up after the penalty. The Axemen will accept the penalty. That was a clear hold. Good call by the officials. Second down. Go! Walker steps back into the pocket. Tight end on the right side. Tonight. Dropping back. He's hit hard, and he'll be sacked down at the 16-yard line. That brings up fourth down. They were able to make the completion, but they'll come up well short Tonight. of the first down. Hubbard on the punt. Fielded at the 29-yard line. This drive represents a great opportunity to send the defense reeling. Another score to extend their lead would give them the ability to exercise a lot of control in terms of play calling. Pitches the ball out to the runner. Finally taken down. That will move the chains. Those quick first downs like that really help the offense get into a rhythm. Go. Number 12, back to pass. Caught by number 87. Touchdown! The home team had all cylinders firing on that touchdown. It's up. It's good. Green Bay adds to their score. 14 nothing. You give up more points here, and you almost don't want to walk back to the sidelines to hear it from the coaches. Bugai takes the kickoff. And he's brought down after a return of 28. Overall today, they've been outperformed on offense. It's time for them to buckle down and get things moving if they want any <laughs> chance of turning things around. Throws a pass. Pulled in by number 75. That'll give them a fresh set of downs. A good first down for the defense is an incomplete pass or a <laughs> short run. Not another first down. The ball's on the ground. The QB will be sacked in the back at the 48. Second down. Second down and long. Hike. Quarterback to pass. Another sack for the defense. This one will push the offense back to the 46-yard line. That signals the end of the first quarter.
The Axemen up so far. 14 nothing. Go. Walker dropping back. He throws one. Martinez makes the reception. There's a penalty marker on the field. We'll see if the penalty affects the outcome. Green Bay elects to decline the penalty. Everyone was covered up by the first down line. The only option they had was to check down for a shorter completion and hope the receiver could make a few people miss. He punts it away. And the kick lands out of bounds, close to the six. The defense has their backs to the wall here. Look for some aggressive blitz packages and tight coverage. Go! Incomplete pass. Second down. He makes the pitch. And he won't make it very far before being dragged down. That brings up third down. That's the right call in that situation. The defense is stacked against the pass and is hoping the offense wants to take a deep shot to try and pick up the first down. He tosses one to the left side of the field. Handing it off to number 27. Finally taken down by number 28. And that's enough for a first down. As good as advertised, Dave. We expected to see some great offense today, and it's coming around. He makes the handoff. That brings up second down. Second and short. Go! He makes the handoff. Miami will call their first time out here. That brings up third down. Hut. Makes the handoff to number 27. Miami calls their second time out. That'll be enough for the first down. The QB lining up under center. He drops back to pass. Robinson pulls it in. Miami will call their third and their final timeout here. That will move the chains. Hike. That's the kind of talent this team has, Dave. Moving the ball at will against a defense that isn't full of slouches. He tosses it to number 27. Third down and short. Tackled quickly. Being able to consistently convert third and short makes all the difference in the world. First down and goal. Hike. And he steps in for six. Touchdown. The linemen take pride in that kind of play. The defense brings out its best gap filters, and the back still finds a way in. And it's good. Green Bay extends their lead, 21-0. That score is important as it is now creates a two-possession lead for the home team. Makes the return up to the 29-yard line. So much of football is mental. The offense needs to get a score in this drive to build some right. confidence if they want any shot of coming back in this game. Second down. Second down and long. Walker dropping back. And he goes down. Sacked down at the nine. 
On third and long, the defense will likely be in a soft zone. The receiver will need to find that gap in the coverage and show the QB his number. As a QB, your guys have to help you out. Sure, bad throws happen, but when it hits your hands, you have to make the play. Hike! Hubbard punts it away. Fielded at the 35. The defense has their backs to the wall here. Look for some aggressive blitz packages and tight coverage. The second quarter comes to a close. Green Bay with the lead. 21-0. Here comes the kicking team. Kennedy boots it. Bugai catches the kickoff. And he's brought down after a return of 30. Well, we've got a report from Emma Adams down on the field. Emma, what do you have for us? Dave, Mike, I spoke Tonight. briefly with the coach for Green Bay during halftime. His team is no stranger to a game plan gone bad, so it might be premature to call this run defense a lost cause. However, it was also pretty brutal first half for Tonight. them. Sometimes opponents don't always do what you expect them to, and he said it'll be an uphill battle getting these guys to go out there and defend the run better. Back to you. We appreciate the update, Emma. Drops back into the pocket. Throws to the sideline deep downfield, and he can't reel it in. This is exactly why third and long is so hard to convert. It takes time for the receivers to get to the first down marker, and by then, the QB is under pressure and forced to make a difficult throw. The kick is caught at the 9. The away team could really use a big play here on defense, something to spark a comeback. <laughs> Makes the throw, and they can't connect. Incomplete. Second down for the Axemen. The quarterback dropping back. Heaves a pass. And he misses his mark. A crucial third down for the offense. Hurls a pass. He can't bring it in. Even though that pass was incomplete, those are the types of throws that stretch a defense. The D was up to the challenge that time. Number 23 takes the punt. The offense needs to get to work here. They've got an uphill road ahead of them to retake the lead and would do well to get things rolling now. Walker back to pass. Uncorks this one, and he misses his mark. With the gloves these guys have today, drops should be a thing of the past. Walker drops back. Fires a ruck past the first down. And he misses his mark. Drops can get into your head as a receiver. Just like interceptions with QBs, you have to have a short right. memory with mistakes and move past it. Penalty marker on the field. Let's see how the penalty affects things. Green Bay will accept the penalty. Penalties have a way of taking the air out of a team's confidence or momentum. <laughs> the Axeman sends men on the blitz. Joe makes the catch. That'll bring up fourth down. The defense executed perfectly on that play. Cover the top to take away the first down pass and force the short throw. Now they're in a fourth down situation. The punt will sail out of bounds. The away team could really use a big play here on defense. Something to spark a comeback. The Axeman starts the drive Fight. from the five-yard line. It's caught by number 83. That gets us to second down. That's enough for a first down. That's a well-executed run to move the chains. Go! Hike! Grant takes the handoff. Second down. Hike. He drops back. Tosses the ball deep down the right side of the field. And he misses his mark. 
The third quarter comes to an end. The home team up so far. 21 nothing. A crucial third down for the offense. Tonight. And he's in for the score. The linemen take pride in that kind of play. The defense brings out its best Tonight. gap filters, and the back still finds a way in. And it's good. Green Bay adds to their score. 28 nothing. The away team needs to get their act together, or this game might slip out of the reach. Kennedy sends this one to the left side of the field. Bugai takes the kick. And he's brought down after a return of 26. Overall today, they've been outperformed on offense. It's time for them to buckle down and get things moving if they want any chance of turning things around. Throws a heater deep down the center of the field. And he can't reel it in. Hike. Another sack for the defense. This one will push the offense back to the 31-yard line. The Rucker steps back into the pocket. Fourth down. Everyone was covered up by the first down line. The only option they had was to check down for a shorter completion and hope the receiver could make a few people miss. Taken at the 19. The home team needs to play it smart here. They're in control of this game and need to focus on not making mistakes. The handoff is taken by number 27. That gets us to second down. The QB hands it off. Third down. On third and long, the defense will likely be in a soft zone. The receiver will need to find that gap in the coverage and show the QB his number. Number 12, dropping back. Green grabs the ball out of the air. And that's enough for a first down. A fresh set of downs for the offense. First and ten. Hike. Pitches the ball out to the runner. Miami takes their first time up. That brings up second down. Number 12. Lining up on the center. He makes the handoff. The runner breaks free. Miami will use their second time out here. Third down. The Axemen with two backs in the backfield. He drops back to pass. Airs one out off to the sideline. Touchdown! Not to be biased, Dave, but that's all on the QB. He read the defense perfect, selected the target, and released the ball exactly when he needed to. And it's good! Green Bay widens the gap a bit with that score. 35 nothing. In many ways, this one was not the game we expected, Dave. But certainly, this type of lead has made a statement. The away team needs to get something going on this drive. He steps back to pass. Finds a target. Pulled in by number 10. That will move the chains. Talk about rifling a pass in there, Dave. Next week, I'm bringing him duck hunting with me. I can save money on bullets with this guy. Second and long. Hike. Quarterback to pass. Makes a hard throw along the sideline. That gets us to third down. Boy, Dave, you talk about a bullet pass. That ball could have been pulled over mid-flight. Do you know how fast you were going there, son? Incomplete. Miami with a single back in the backfield. Hike. Walker looking to pass. The receiver can't bring it in. Failed fourth down conversions can often be the turning point in a game. The offense couldn't get it done, and now the other team will take over on downs. Green Bay will begin the drive from the 47. Throws one deep down the field. The pass falls harmlessly to the ground. 
Steps, in Steps into the pocket. Throws the ball. Touchdown! On short pass attempts near the goal line, the defense is going to be spread out across the end zone. The quarterback did a great job of finding a seam between the players for the touchdown. It's good! Green Bay widens the gap a bit with that score. 42 nothing. And now, Dave, the backups are kind of begging for some game time. And the kick goes out of bounds. The offense needs to get to work here. They've got an uphill road ahead of them to retake the lead and would do well to get things rolling now. Pressure coming from the defense. And they can't connect. Incomplete. Go! The Axemen sending pressure. Martinez makes a nice catch. He scores! You know, the running back will sit and beg for the ball on those short distances. So it's always nice to see the QB pass that pigskin in for six. And it's good! Miami reclaims some lost ground. 42-7. The away team got the ball rolling with that score. Now, they need a big stop and another score to keep the momentum going. It's going to take multiple possessions for the defense to get back into this game. I'm expecting a lot of runs on this drive to keep the clock moving. And it's intercepted by number 40. We heard it often that quarterbacks need to have a short-term memory when it comes to mistakes. That's so true. He needs to move past this interception and put it out of his mind. Mike, you know what time it is. We're all anxious to hear who you've got as the stun of the game. Who is it? Walters for the home team. Made the whole team better today and earned my stud award. Talk about a guy that loves football. It really showed on the field today.